what do you like about this team from what you've seen here the first couple weeks of practice? Um, our defense has looked really good. Um, I mean, scrimmages have gone well. Our pitch has been attacking. Hitters with him good at bats. Uh, I feel like we're just solid. I mean, first off, I think it's a more talented team than the past couple of years. We had some guys come in, some pretty good freshmen, some uh, tran JUCO transfers, D1 transfers that are eligible to play this year. Um, but just overall, the team chemistry, um, just overall winning attitude. I feel like last year there was like there was something missing last year mm -hmm. and year before that. I feel like everyone this year is on board. Everyone wants to win. Everyone wants to do everything they can to help this team win. And I think that's really what's going to be different on the mental side. All right. You guys sort of maybe took a little bit more ownership in the off season. The players did of, of getting guys together. Yeah, so was, I think, that, was that a big priority? Yeah, I think so. I think definitely because uh, the team. I you know it's a, we're a lot of the same age now. I think there was some like, there was a lot of difference in age in the, uh, in the past teams, and now that we've all kind of come up together, we've, we know each other a lot better. We've got a lot more team chemistry going on, and uh, that helps to uh, try to set those up. And I think that's really going to help. Where it's going to pay off in the season too, a lot more reps because you know we don't get out on the field till the snow goes away. So <laughs> <laughs> trying to play in spring break, and we'll see we'll see if the snow holds off then too, but. Uh, but yeah, that, that getting that extra rep, getting that um, like just getting that chemistry together is really gonna help us out. We have consistency and experience. Yeah. Um, I felt like last year we were a little, we had some highs and we had some lows, um, which kind of cost us, uh, especially in uh, losing as many one-run games in the conference as we did. Um, I think that'll be a key for us and find the ways to win those one uh, one-run games. Uh, and uh, winning the rubber match in the series, yeah. game three, uh, where it's tied one-one. Uh, could be huge. Uh, uh, completely change the weekend. Uh, so. Help this year to you know sort of have been close and maybe know what it takes to, to take that next step. Yeah, I think and going back to the mental side and I think the last three innings are the most mental out of any part of the ball game. I feel like and we have a lot of guys returning from last year's team, a lot of upperclassmen, a lot of juniors that I think are going to be able to help out with keeping everybody focused, keeping everybody on board, especially late in the game, you know, when games go into three, four hour mark into extra innings. I think the like senior, junior leadership and um, the mental aspect of doing anything it takes to win, I think that's gonna help us in close games.